good day everyone uh, thank you for watching this video uh, today's video I'm going to uh, walk you through a step-by-step -step instruction on how to set a password for your Outlook data file okay now before um, uh, I I start walking you through the step-by-step uh, -step instruction I uh, just want to give you a, a small insight about what is Outlook data file now Outlook data file is nothing but Outlook storage file if you see the file extension uh, you would see as uh, .pst which is nothing but personal storage file now what information is stored in Outlook data file Outlook data file is nothing but it contains all your emails what you receive in your Outlook your contacts what you have created in Outlook your calendar events what you have created in Outlook your meeting events your journals your folders uh, subfolders what you have created in Outlook uh, your task and your uh, meeting appointments all this information is stored in Outlook data file now let's say you don't want to um, um, you know a sec third person to access your Outlook data file you can always encrypt your Outlook data file so I'm going to walk you through step-by-step -step instruction on how to set a password for your Outlook data file now before you set an Outlook data file what you need to do is you need to open Outlook on your computer and do a right click on Outlook data file uh, in this case I have only one Outlook data file if you have multiple Outlook data file in your Outlook you can set password uh, individual password for each Outlook data file so once you do a right click on it click, go to data properties go to advanced and click on change password okay um, so this is a default option what you have so old password you can type it as uh, since I don't have a password set up I'm going to leave it blank and the new password I'm going to assign a password test and when you set a password always make sure you don't check the box which says save this password in your password list because what it will does does is uh, it will save your password so there's uh, there's no uh, point in setting a password always make sure this box is unchecked when you are setting a password okay so click on ok click on ok again and click on ok again so I'm going to close Outlook and uh, walk it, show you how it works so I'm going to open Outlook so whenever I open Outlook uh, I will not be able to access any of your any of my emails which are stored in Outlook data file contacts or calendar until and unless I set up uh, I type the password so I'm going to type the password which I've already set and once I type the password um, uh, I will be able to access uh, the data what is being saved in the Outlook so this is how you set uh, Outlook a password for your Outlook data file. I hope this video will uh, will will be useful for you guys to encrypt your password because I've seen a lot of uh, users or a lot of uh, uh, queries over the internet asking questions on how to how to set a password for the Outlook data file. If you have liked this video, please click on the like button and also subscribe to my channel uh, so that you get notification for all the upcoming videos which will be which i will be uploading in future thank you for watching my video have a nice day